FAMAS. It has the highest rate of fire tied with the CZ3A1, with a mind-boggling 1,000 rounds per minute. You'd be hard-pressed not to down someone in less than a second. That's if the magazine size doesn't give out on you. So what is the FAMAS? Well, the FAMAS is an assault class weapon. It sports a 25 round magazine with one in the chamber and three firing modes, fully automatic, three round burst and semi-automatic. Although, I wouldn't recommend the last one. The FAMAS is a bullpup rifle designed and manufactured in France by the now closed MAS in 1978. I tried to pronounce what MAS stands for, but I'm not French, so I won't. <laughs> What's a bullpup rifle, you say? Well, it's essentially a rifle that places the magazine behind the trigger. The main advantage is being better muzzle velocity and improved effective range. This, however, comes at a cost. Reloading the weapon takes a bit more time and the recoil is felt more. Battlefield 4 has done an excellent job of translating these quirks to the FAMAS in-game. The gun is a wild horse, and if you're not careful, you spend your whole mag not hitting a single shot, making you take on the hefty reload time of 3.55 seconds when empty. Like, if you're in a gunfight and you gotta wait 3.55 seconds to reload, you're dead, I'm sorry. All in all, the FAMAS is definitely a risky weapon, but if you can control the recoil, then you'll have a field day, especially in close quarters, where bullpup rifles shine. Speaking of shine, the FAMAS is no longer the shining star of the French armed forces. The last batch of FAMAS weapons were made in 2002, shortly before MAS closed. They did see extensive use up until 2016, but has since been replaced by the German-made HK416 rifle. The reason being, the FAMAS is an old gun, and it uses non-NATO standard ammunition. Brass case ammunition, in fact. But, it's not all doom and gloom. The poor FAMAS is still in use in various countries, the majority being all colonies of the French, such as Cameroon, Djibouti and Chad. Yeah, that last one is a country. And an important stage in which conflict with their neighbours to the north, Libya, saw the extensive use of the FAMAS during Operation Manta. Operation Manta is a French intervention operation and the biggest since the colonial era. It saw French forces drawing a red line in the sand, warning Libya against further expansion south. This proved effective and Libya did not push further south. At least while the French were there. But that's not all. The FAMAS was used in other theatres of war, including the Gulf War and Afghanistan, as well as many others. As sad as it is that the rifle will no longer be in service from 2028 onwards, we must note that the legacy of the FAMAS will live long. It's recognised widely as the French assault rifle and almost every first person shooter has their own variant of it, from Rainbow Six Siege to Call of Duty. If you enjoyed our video, then please like and share. If not, then dislike and tell us why in the comments below. Thanks for watching.